I like quiet like this. I love quiet like this. It's 4.40 in the afternoon. Wait for it. Just hang in there. Hold on. These moments are too few and far between. I almost want to sit here one day and count the number of 18 wheelers that go by. On a Saturday or Sunday afternoon when it's beautiful weather, I'll count the number of motorcycles that go by. And on a Saturday, you hear them as late as 10 o'clock at night, 11 o'clock at night, even midnight. Rice runner. This sucks. I did not even take this into consideration when I decided to take the apartment because it's weird to call it an apartment. It's the downstairs of a house. And there's two units, someone lives upstairs. This just sucks. But I had a very difficult time finding a place to live. There aren't many vacancies right now and a lot of landlords are scum deciding, well, you need to have you need to have a, a job that pays so much money. See how noisy this is? This is just so bothersome to me. I'm in New Hampshire for crying out loud. I want to be living where it's nice and quiet. And the amount of cars you hear in a day would be a grand total of zero. It's definitely not this. Like I said, I didn't take it into consideration. I just, the, the, the place was offered to me. I took it. Thankfully, my lease does not have an end date written on it, which means technically, legally, with 30 days notice, I can leave here. But instead of leaving to rent somewhere else, which might get me a year's lease, um, definitely a year's lease with an end date. I'd rather save money to hopefully be able to buy a house with a mortgage, of course. Um, before the, before one year is up here, which would be March, March 1st ish next year. Technically, I moved in on the 6th, I believe, so technically, yeah, I signed a lease on the 6th, so probably, you know, March 1st. I'd rather allow the cats to keep having this home, which they just love right now, as far as, as, far as the running and the playing. They do not like the noise outside the front windows, that's for sure. But to actually have my own place on a street where I'm not going to hear cars go by like this, no 18 wheelers and no Harley Davidsons, 
that would just be wonderful absolutely wonderful we'll see I've got to make it happen I think a Porsche Cayenne just went by alright that's the end of this nonsense video love my traffic I wonder if anyone watching this has traffic as bad as this out their front window oh my god this sucks peace and quiet at like you know midnight maybe but then you still get cars going by occasionally it won't it won't stop it really won't stop I mean midnight one two in the morning but that means I gotta stay up late and wake up late in the morning oi Oh, and the police cars and the ambulances? Oh, almost every day. 18 wheelers. None none have come by in the past six, six minutes, but, um, yeah, enough of those come by every single day. Big dump trucks, trucks with trailers, and, and the motorcycles, like I mentioned, the motorcycles. Oh, my God. Unbelievable. This absolutely sucks. Oh, not to mention the fact that um, there's like a, a warehouse sort of building across the street, which I'm sure helps the sound over here because it echoes backwards or it bounces instead of drifting off into the woods or something or being absorbed by trees. Yeah, you get pickups and, and little Japanese douchebag cars that think they're all badass. And every day, like, about this time, every day, like, this one pickup truck feels the need to floor it right down the street. From, like, right outside front, he floors it. And he's, he's rumbling. This is just nuts. Well, if anyone's actually watched all of this and listened to my rambling, I commend you. You get a gold star. I thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. You know, maybe this video probably doesn't deserve a like, and I understand that, but I'd appreciate one anyway. That'd be awesome. All right. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.